Oh god. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's close. Now, I've been working fast food for a while now. I think I'm ready for a shift like this. Oh no, I'll be late for work. Oh god. Not oh god. Don't want that to happen. I should be on my car by now. Take a shit real quick. Oh god. Alright, uh... We're just gonna leave barefoot? <laughs> nobody, nobody cares, apparently. Oh, we somehow got shoes on. Oh, we're a woman. Look at, look at us strutting our stuff. Look at that. Oh, look at that. The model runway walk. Someone's iPhone. Oh, excuse me. Oh, what is your neck doing, buddy? What is going on there? Excuse me. Hey, uh, are you looking for something? Well, I found this. Gimme it. Gimme me it. Okay. I'm going to work. Oh god. Oh god. It is raining quite a bit right now. Quite a thunderstorm meow. Ooh, ooh. Cozy vibes. I'm really fucking with that. I'm not gonna lie. Put away my stuff and talk to senpai. Oh. Put away my stuff. Talk to this dude that's that's got a cold. Sorry I'm late. Kunahashi senpai. Be careful. Next time I'm going to tell the manager. So who shoved that gigantic stick up your ass? Being careful is not enough. Tell me you won't be late. Do you understand? Bro! Stop being a dick rider. This dude is a D1 meat rider for our manager. Yes sir, I'll not be late again. You also mess up some orders, don't you? If you have any trouble with the order, there are some tutorial videos for you, so look through it. You better not be texting anyone during work. Bro, who the fuck are you? Who the fuck are you? Shut the hell up. Shut up. Nobody loves you. Bro, this is why he has no bitches. No bi absolutely no bitches. I feel uneasy. There's something strange about this place. My daughter seems to be a fan of this place, and now I'm here. However, uh, I'll leave the drinks to you. Oh, and I'd like to get two of them. Would you want a latte and a coffee? Oh, that'll be just fine. It's really uncomfortable here. Lid, latte, easy, take your order, get out of here! Yeah, good boy, good bitch, that's what I thought. Who the hell are you to come in here and complain about the prices? Yeah, you... Get your bitch ass out of here. You know, if I was working this late at night and it was only me and one other person, I would just, like, if I was hungry- Whoa, why- You're zooming, dude! I would just, like, steal pastries whenever I want and just eat them. Saren, did you hear on the news? I hear stalker cases are on the rise. It's scary. A woman like me, you see, I have to be careful. A woman with a fucked up chin. Holy shit, what is that? Goddamn. All the guys are always staring at me, so... You are not her. You are not like that. <laughs> you are not like that. You be careful, too. Well, you don't have to worry as much as I do, but you should watch out either way. Damn! <laughs> Damn, bro! What the fuck? What a bitch! Get out of my store. A dark mocha chip chill pacino, please? What the fuck is a chill pacino? Chocolate chip chill pacino. Blended ice plus coffee plus milk. Okay, okay, this, this is. Okay, wait, is it a hot or cold? I don't even know. Milk, ice, chocolate sauce, cocoa powder. Milk, ice. Sauce I forgot the milk. I forgot the milk! I have to redo it! God damn it. Oh, I'm alone. You know what that means. I could just steal whatever food I want. That's what I do at McDonald's, dude. Like, when there's no one at McDonald's and I have nothing to do, I'll take a small fry to the back and just eat it. Or I'll just start eating it. I don't care. Oh god, a matcha cake, please. Stop pushing me. Salted caramel mocha... Then I'll have a matcha chili pacino. You always can't finish your drink, so let's share, man. Sure, let's do that. One pumpkin cake. I think I'll have something to eat too. You can order first. I'll have um hot cocoa. Hot cocoa? Are you serious? I don't have any money right now. You should have said that first. Come on, I'll buy you one. What do you want to drink? Yes, but just say it. he's got money. No, it's not like that. But really, anything is fine. Really, I want a white mocha. 
Okay, any food? No, uh, just a drink. Oh, come on, let's order some food. But, uh, okay, American waffles. Waffles? Uh, thanks, both of you. Can't believe you remembered all that. I didn't, I guessed! <laughs> we'll be waiting. Oh, God! Hazelnut syrup, chocolate sauce. Chocolate sauce... Hazelnut syrup... Oh, these, these guys are getting... Every disease known to man, holy shit. Hey, buddy, how's it going? Here's my order. You're just... Where the fuck is my water? God damn it. I left it open. At your job, what's the strangest order you've gotten? Ooh, that's a good one. So, a few shifts ago, I was at McDonald's, and this lady, she ordered 120 chicken McNuggets. And I ran the order out to her, and I said, 120 nuggets? And she's like, yeah. So I, I was just making small talk. I was like, you throwing a party? And she's like, no, actually, my son's autistic. And I, uh, he'll only eat chicken McNuggets. So I have to always get him a ton of nuggets. It's really not that hard. Not that I've ever parented, but I can't imagine it's hard to tell your son no to 120 nuggets for dinner and make him something healthy, you know? She reheats them over the days for, like, breakfast, lunch, dinner, etc. That's cr- Dude, if that's the case, that's ridiculous. Because, dude, imagine, like... Imagine fucking being that bitch made that you can't tell your son no. Like, bro, being autistic doesn't mean you can't eat other foods besides chicken nuggets. That's not what being autistic is. Come on, I'm gonna get a lot of hate for that, but just become a better parent. Tell your child no once in a while, you know? Hey, I'm a private investigator. You spot anything suspicious around the area? Yeah, a woman that keeps ordering a shit ton of chicken nuggets. There have been numerous reports of people getting harassed. I was wondering if you've seen anything in the store. Call me if something ever happens. Try closing the store early if you don't want to get in trouble. Okay. Thank you, investigator. Thank you. The only suspicious thing around here is you, but thank you. Suki Tayo is ableist confirmed. <laughs> I'm very ableist. Take your autistic ass and your nuggets somewhere else. <laughs> it's a joke, it's a joke. Don't don't ban me Twitch, please. It's a joke. Oh, come on. You know what they say. Don't cry over spilt milk. Excuse me? It's invincible? What the fuck? What is this? I'm clicking the button. Oh, you're supposed to put it back in the fridge. That's so stupid. That's, like, really dumb. Why would you do that? Because, like, it was on the floor. What type of... What type of sanitary, like, what type of... Bro, the FDA is gonna get on the restaurant's ass for that. Why would you put spilled milk that was on the floor back into the fridge? Are we broke here? Are we broke? Do we not have enough money to just, like, throw the, the gross spilled floor milk away? Is that not how things work around here? Oh, this is kind of cool. Is that, like, where my bed is and shit? Can I, like, get up here to see if it's, like, that's actually sick. Dude, I would love to live in a cute little Japanese apartment like this. I would, I would pay money to live in this apartment. Because it's not, you're joking, right? Yeah, oh, hey, how's it going? Hey, seriously, you're late again? Did you oversleep? I'm so sorry. No, not, I'm so sorry. I want you to not be late. <laughs> How about I just murder you? And it's the second time that you failed to get some bitches. This is why you get no bitches, because you're getting on your female co-worker's ass about being late. Maybe you'd get some play, maybe a crumb. I'm sorry, a little more enthusiasm would help, don't you think? This is why you've never felt the touch of a woman. Why don't you ask your mama to wake you up? Bro's jealous he doesn't have a mom. 
All right, what's what's on the agenda today? Hey, hey, Pops. How's it going, Pop? Oh, wait, why does he look mad weird? Jesus. Just, just, just coffee. Okay, so we're, so we're bare bones. We're, uh, he likes it black. He likes his coffee like he likes his women. Hot and black. Hey, girl, thank you very much. Hmm, aha, uh -huh, you look impressed. No need to Nihongo Juzo me. Oh, oh, he's American, and he has, he has good Japanese, and she's shocked that his Japanese is so good. Okay, that guy looks like white Steve Harvey. <laughs> I've been living here for more than 15 years. Hey girl, something's not right about this place. I didn't think that because I'm not around town. Something about this store. Maybe because of that guy over there. Huh? I guess it was just my imagination. Are you haunted by any chance? Well, maybe I am. Haha. Uh -huh. Either way, I'm running late, so I'm gonna have to go. So long. You're not even gonna say anything? Just gonna... You just- you just want- you just- you just want milk? You just want two cups of milk? What type of psycho is this? Excuse me? You're just gonna- you're just gonna come in here and you're gonna get two cups of milk? Like it's all- like everything's A-OK. -okay. Like everything's normal. Like nothing really happened. You're cute, can I have your number? Um, would you like to order anything? Mm hmm your heart. <laughs> I think I'll go with your recommendation. What's your name? Tell me your name. Our recommendation would be the limited time only double chocolate chilla puccino. I see. What's your phone number? I'm that good looking, aren't I? I'd lose words myself. I'm quite popular around here. Now is your chance. How, how do you say that? How do you say the star? What? Just contact me, okay? Alright. We're gonna do this. Thanks. I'll definitely call you. Get the fuck out of here, bitch boy. I don't swing that way. Get lost. Take out trash and bus tables. I'm gonna bust on the tables. Seriously? I don't want to bust the tables. I don't want to bust on the tables. I'd rather bust in my bed. What are you talking about, my boy? Have you gone off the deep end, my boy? Oh god, oh my god, oh god, oh my god, I almost died. What the fuck? Yep, yep. How's it going, bitch boy? Today's your first closing shift. I have a question. Do you get strange customers around at night? Well, sometimes we do. Just brush it off as they come. Focus on your work. There's plenty to do. Actually, I'm afraid I might be being stalked. Ah, uh, you want me to believe someone is interested in the likes of you? And this is why he's never had a girlfriend. I guess I'll come flying to help you if anything ever happens. Haha. -ha. My instincts tell me that he doesn't give a shit. Sorry, I'm going to the bathroom. Can you order a macchiato for me? Okay. I'll have a cinnamon roll churros, a cup of coffee, please, and add whipped cream to it. You're gonna eat that much? No wonder you got so fat. <laughs> it's wild. Easy. Easy. Light work, no reaction. Light work. Oh. What, what did I not do? Cap, I did not mess that up. That's BS. What, what if he ducks me? Scary. That's what I'm saying. Uh, latte, latte, please. Don't worry, no one wants to kidnap you. Damn! <laughs> oh, by the way, have you seen any ghosts lately? No, I see. You'll be fine then. Dude, what? What was that about? I don't know. Must be the stress of poverty. Poor guy. Uh, I get it. <laughs> Poor guy. <laughs> Oh god, I gotta bust the tables again. I gotta bust on the tables, alright. I wish having a job was really this easy. Because working at McDonald's is not this easy. That ish is tiring. Who the hell are you? Um, hello? Can I help you, sir?
the day we first met. Yes, at Chilla's, she smiled at me like a flower. Just thinking about her it makes my heart pound. I've never felt this way before. I wonder if she's putting a smile on everyone's face like she does mine. What the fuck? You're a weirdo, my boy. My boy, you are weird. That is not normal. At all. What the fuck? What the fuck? Uh, I know her best. Maybe after your mother and father. I'll really be number one in time. She talked to me. She picked up my phone and went out of her way to give it to me. I knew she felt the same way I did. We're in love. Today's our anniversary. Kappa. A stalker is the guy at the beginning of the game you gave the phone. Oh. Oh. Ah! <laughs> God. You scared the shit out of me. Leave me alone when I'm in the restroom. God damn it. This is chill. What the, what the fuck is going on with you, huh? What the fuck is going on with you, huh? What the fuck? Do you, do you want to, to... Do you want to order? <laughs> what the fuck? This guy is baked out of his mind. Holy shit. <laughs> Hey, come on, I won't be here for long. <laughs> Very cool. Oh my god, not again. What the fuck? Uh, what the fuck? Uh, 1 11 27? 1. Four. Shit, am I being timed? What? 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 Latte. Oh, I gotta make it by memory? Again, dude, what the fuck? How many lattes do you want? Why do you keep coming back? Nobody, nobody asked you to come back. Excuse me? Minus one, minus one. Two degrees Celsius. What the fuck is two degrees Celsius? Please let me out. Please let me out. I've asked nicely. I don't want to have to use force. What the fuck? Uh, excuse me? Oh, this dude's back. So my suspicions were true. I'm glad you contacted me. Calling the police won't help. All they'll do is brush things off to lessen their workload. That's facts, though. That's That sucks. Oh, is today the day of the photo shoot or something? Is the story going to be featured in the newspaper? Uh, no, I don't think so. Why? What? But I saw someone outside taking pictures. No, dude! Huh, was he taking pictures of the store? Hmm, yeah, the store and you, most likely. Damn it, should've done my makeup. What are you- Without even looking at the board. Hey, are you repairing the store's antenna at this hour? Antenna, no, ma'am. Why? I saw someone on the roof. What? There shouldn't be anyone on the roof. Could be the investigator, maybe I should check it out. Could have been my imagination. Anyway, the drink, please. So, where am I climbing onto the roof on? Climb, oh yes. Yes, make sure make sure the ladder goes three rungs above. Oh, not OSHA certified. Nope. Oh, what? Wait a minute. What the hell? Someone's been living here. Holy shit. It's the stuff from this restaurant. I have to close the store fast. Put the sign up closed. Okay. That's crazy. Holy shit. I was expecting it though because I've seen this jump scare a million times. So I know what I'm doing. Wait, no, what if, if I go outside, is he just gonna kill me? Why am I unscrewing this? What even- what even is this? What the fuck? Okay, oh shit! He's banging on the outside door, okay, yeah, yeah, I need to- I need to leave. I need to fucking leave, dude. Oh god. The detective! Oh no. The freaking detective got killed, dude. Holy shit. What? I didn't do that. 
Better hope he didn't follow you, lady. Oh, shit. He did. He fucking climbed in the trunk, little bastard. Okay, so I actually have to... I actually have to go and escape. What if I go out the back? And I... Ah! Is he molested? Did I just get molested? Oh... I see... Rick? Wait, I'm gonna kill him? <laughs> oh, he's cooked. Oh, somebody's dead. Oh, okay. <laughs> Waiting around the corner to kill me. Fuck you. Fuck you. You're dead, buddy. You're I killed a man. As I picked up the brick, that man looked right at me. If I didn't drop it, I thought he would somehow get inside and kill me. That man looked terrifying. I don't even know him. Why did he... I had no choice. I mean to kill him. I was scared. I ran to the police. I told, I told the police everything that happened. Then the police took me back to the scene, and that man was no longer there. There was no one there. The police took me back home and told me to leave the rest of us, and went back to investigate the scene. It's all over. I'm tired. Bro. It's all over. I'm tired after all that happened. Now I want to rest peacefully at home. That's crazy. The fact he didn't even die. Cable's acting weird again. I should call the owner. Where's my phone? Oh, hell no. Now I'm gonna get fucking killed. Oh my god, it's, it's just sitting out there. How does that even happen? Oh my god, dude. It's literally a trap. I'm walking right into a trap. I'm gonna get fucking killed. I'm gonna get fucking killed. He's he's not dead. He's just gonna kill me. I'm literally just gonna die. It really is that simple. I'm just gonna die. And there's nothing I can do to prevent it. I have to do this because it's a storyline. Oh god. Oh god, hello. Hello, 911. Oh god. Oh god, 911, please help. Oh god. Oh god. Wait, what am- why am I worrying? I'm fine. I'm actually just fine. What? What? I'm fine? Holy shit. He didn't kill me? I'm- I'm chilling? What the fuck? Oh. Now I'm gonna fucking die. Oh, yep, he's in the closet, isn't he? Yup, yup, yup. Oh god, oh god. 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 That was. Dude, that fucking game. Holy shit. <laughs> I love these games so much, dude. They're so well made. Holy shit. This one especially? This one was scary because it could actually happen in real life. It's not like a demonic, like a ghost thing, like most of the other games I play. But this one is like a realistic game, just like uh, the Fierce of Fathom games that could actually happen in real life, which is what makes it so scary. So, uh, yeah, if you guys want to see me play more Tales of Horror games, make sure to like and subscribe, and let me know in the comments down below, which- Oh god, <laughs> what the fuck? I'm not- I'm not a teenager that just started puberty, I don't know what's going on. But yeah, let me know which, uh, games you guys want to see me play next, leave like and subscribe if you guys want to see me play more Chillis Art Horror games, and, uh, yeah, that's gonna be it. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.